JP Shadrick with Jaguars eighth year left tackle Cam Robinson. That's coming off my tongue. I, I couldn't believe it, but your face says it all, right? Yeah, yeah. Um, damn. Um, eight years. It's flown by. That's the crazy part. That's what I keep telling people is that it flies by. And um, if you don't take a, if you don't take a moment to kind of just step back and kind of just take a look at the whole picture every once in a while, it'll be here and gone before you know it. So just kind of trying to appreciate these days. And um, coming back after the way last season ended, mm -hmm. this offseason program's underway. Phase two is here now. What's been the overall mood, the overall emphasis the first few weeks, getting everybody back in the same building again? Um, I think this part of the season, is, um, this part of the offseason is always fun just because you kind of get a chance to be back around the guys. Um, once we get that break and once you've been away from, for, for a while, it's just kind of like it feels good to get back in the locker room and kind of get that bun and kind of start that bun and kind of start the building towards where we want to be for next year. And this is a, a tight group. It's also a veteran group now, and it, it even gets a little bit older. You added Mitch Morse into the mix. Mm -hmm. Of course, Cleveland re-signed. Sheriff gets extended. You're around. Mm -hmm. I mean, the youngin is the second-year guy on the right side, and, and Anton mm -hmm. Harrison. Shatley's back again. Mm -hmm. So this group's been together for a long time. So how does this group, being together for so long, take the next step of, as, as an offensive line? And what are some of those steps you guys need to take? It's just chemistry. It's as simple as that. It's just the same five guys playing together, down in and down out, just getting those reps. Um, I mean, it's kind of hard to, that kind of gets lost in the, people don't realize how much up front, you really got to be a unit. So, I mean, it's, if we're interchanging guys in and out, or we're, there's never any inconsistency about, if there's never any consistency about what we're doing, it's going to be hard to kind of form that bond and just all of us working as one. So, the same five guys, you know, getting these reps is, you can't even put the, is, it's invaluable. How have you spent the early part of your offseason? I know you, you were banged up a little bit for about a month. You missed four games at the end of last season. Mm -hmm. Came back, though, for the last two weeks and got back in the lineup. Any uh, hangover from that, and and are you healthy fully? Yeah, I'm fully healthy. I've just been um, not much. My offseason has been pretty calm. I've been a dad. I'm a new dad now. So oh, congrats. Thank you. So um, that's pretty much just been. That's all I've been doing. How has that changed Cam Robinson, being a, a dad? Um, I think it just adds a little bit more patience to whatever you know. You got to learn patience, and you have to learn to just sometimes just take take a step back and take a breath, and just um, you know, keep everything in perspective. But I think it probably be my patience is what has changed the most. <laughs> All right. So final thought here. What what are some of your goals for the next uh, couple months here until mid June off season program for an offensive line? There's not a lot of contact, really, no contact going on mm -hmm. for the next couple months. So. Uh, what do you personally need to get out of these next two months? Just like I mentioned earlier, just the five guys that we got, just keep building that, keep building that, um, keep building that relationship with us five out there together, and just keep taking those steps forward, trying to be where we're trying to be. It's phase two in OTAs. I mean, we're not going to be where we want to be right now, and that's completely fine. But we need to be taking the steps we need to be taking to get to where we want to be, and um, you know, when it's time to go in the fall. Congrats on the baby, and uh, good luck to you the rest of the way here. Appreciate it. Appreciate you.